Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into an incredible story about Kobe Bryant's special relationship with Michael Jordan and the relentless pursuit of greatness that caused him to miss his team buses on multiple occasions. Let's jump into why that was. Michael Jordan often referred to Kobe as his little brother. But before their relationship blossomed into a deep friendship, Kobe was determined to learn everything he could from his idol. This determination led to some memorable and unique situations. According to former Lakers trainer Gary Vitti, Kobe's obsession with Jordan was so intense that the team bus would often leave him behind. Vitti recalls, and I quote, I'm the guy that counted the heads on the bus and told the bus driver, okay, now we can move, we have everybody. And we were always one head short with Kobe. Why was Kobe always left behind? After every game against the Bulls, he would wait outside the locker room hoping to catch a moment with Michael Jordan. The problem? MJ was always the last to leave, taking his time with treatments, reviewing score sheets and waiting for the crowd to disperse. Tim Grover, Jordan's trainer who later then trained Kobe, often overheard their conversations. Kobe would ask about footwork, turnaround shots and anything else he could learn. Grover said, and I quote, there's a bunch of other athletes that came up to Michael that wanted him to mentor them. But when they found out how difficult it was to maintain that intensity and to be that relentless, most of them faded out. But Kobe kept up. The more information that Michael gave him, Kobe got even more thirsty. Brian's persistence was so intense that it initially irritated those around him, including MJ. But there was something about Kobe that drew Jordan in. During his speech at Kobe's memorial, MJ shared how what was once annoying became endearing. He said, and I quote, You know, all of us have brothers and sisters, little brothers, little sisters. For whatever reason, always tend to get in your stuff, your closet, your shoes and everything. It was a nuisance, if I can say that word, but that nuisance turned into love over a period of time. Kobe's relentless pursuit of greatness didn't stop at the post-game locker room conversations. After Jordan gave him his number, Kobe would call MJ at all hours, asking questions about the game, life and everything in between. This dedication paid off in a Hall of Fame career, a successful businessman and a happy family man in the end. Kobe's story is a testament to the power of relentless pursuit and the impact of having a great mentor. Michael Jordan may have initially been annoyed by his little brother, but their bond grew into something incredibly special. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this story, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more upcoming videos and NBA content. My name is Damien Peters and I will see you next time.